Hey babes, welcome or welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Shaylin and in today's video I'm showing you guys my top 10 jackets for fall. Now these jackets can work for any woman, but especially for us short girls because if you guys don't know, I am only 5 foot so it's really really hard for me to find jackets that are flattering and don't make me look like I'm wearing a paper trash bag. So if you guys want to see what jackets I've been loving for fall, then please keep on watching. Okay, babe, so let's get right into all of the coats that I got because I have plenty, okay? First coat up is this coat that I actually picked up from Zara last year. It is like this beautiful like teddy coat, but it's in sort of like a puffer style. Now one thing I like about this is it has this bunching in at the bottom, which is really, really nice if you're petite. I think when it comes to jackets and you're short, it's so easy for a jacket to swallow you. And one nice thing about this coat is it does not do that. Now it's not the warmest on the inside. It's not really lined with anything to be honest with you guys, but on those Fall days where it's not super duper cold outside, this definitely can look really, really good with your outfit. I did want to let you guys know that I'm going to try on all these coats with the same outfit. That way you guys can see the versatility that these coats have. I really think it's important to up your coat wardrobe. I know I definitely am. I always buy tons and tons of coats because coats are definitely your statement piece in the fall and winter season. I picked this coat up in a size medium if you guys are wondering. Next coat up is this beautiful, beautiful denim jean jacket. Now I picked this up from Urban Outfitters. Again, this was like about a year ago. I absolutely love this jacket. I love how bright the blue color is. It's not your typical jean jacket. I am on the hunt currently for like a vintage dad jean jacket like at your local thrift store. Haven't been able to find one yet, but this one is pretty darn close. Now this coat is really heavy, like my arm is getting worked out right now. It's different from any denim jacket I've seen on other people, so I decided to pick this one up, but any denim jacket will do. So I have another jean jacket, but this one is completely different. As you can see, it is cropped. I picked this up from Topshop. I got it in a size four, which is absolutely the perfect fit for me. It definitely still fits oversized without looking way too big on me. One nice thing about this jacket is for us short girls, it definitely does not make us look shorter. It crops at the perfect length where your legs are still fully visible, which makes you appear taller. I absolutely love, love, love this jean jacket. I've gotten tons of wear out of it. I love the distressing at the bottom and there's so many different ways that you can style this jacket. Next item up is a recent purchase. You guys might have seen this in my recent Zara video. I absolutely love this corduroy jacket. It's in this beautiful baby blue color which I've been loving. The reason I picked up this jacket is because sometimes I don't always want to wear a denim jacket and I think this is a nice twist instead of a typical denim jacket. I love that it's corduroy, which adds some texture to an outfit, which is nice. And I picked this up in a size small and I paid $49.90. I absolutely love this. Chuck this on with an oversized tee, some faux leather pants, a cute bag, and you're good to go. Next coat up has definitely become one of my favorite styles of coats and it is puffer coats. Now I picked this coat up in the summer, I actually got it off season about a year ago from Nike. I think I only paid like $15 for this coat because literally I bought it when it was summertime. One thing I really love about puffer coats is they keep you warm, they do their job, they serve their purpose. Now, when it comes to puffer coats for us short girls, it's so easy for us to look like a marshmallow man. This coat nonetheless does not have too much of a puffiness to the point where I look like a Martian. Okay, so the next coat up is a bomber coat. Now this bomber coat is not your average. It's definitely in a more cropped style. I picked mine up in a size large because I didn't want it to fit super tight and I do not regret picking it up in a bigger size. One nice thing about it is again it has that detailing in the bottom where it cinches in your waist which is nice so it accentuates the body and also does not make you look shorter because your legs are able to fully show. I absolutely love the color of this. I've never seen a jacket in this shade which really drew me to this coat and of course if any of these items are available I will be sure to link them below for you guys. Next item up is literally one of my favorite types of coats, which is a teddy coat. Now this one is a long line teddy coat. Now I do want my short girls to not be afraid to wear long coats. One thing 
about me, I honestly don't care if a coat makes me look short because I am short. It's just a fact period like there's nothing I can do about it but this coat to me hits at the perfect length where it's not too long where I feel like it's almost hitting the ground but it's just like the perfect cutoff length it still gives me that long line coat feel without being too long to the point where it's dragging on the ground I actually got this from pretty little thing so I picked this up in a size us2 now the reason I picked this up in a us2 is because this coat fits very oversized I actually picked it up in a four in the first place and it was just way way too big so I decided to size down and I'm glad that I did because I still have a ton of room to wear sweaters under this I don't remember how much I paid for this coat but I definitely used a 50% off coupon so I think it was about 40 to 50 dollars the next coat up is a trench coat now I absolutely love trench coats this one is actually from forever 21 and I picked this up in a size small now I absolutely love trench coats for the fall season they're definitely a nice lightweight coat to chuck on so I tend to wear this with like a thicker item underneath so if I'm wearing like a thick turtleneck or a thick hoodie of some sort it's also not too long on me and the nice thing about it is it comes with a belt so if you want to cinch in your waist you can do so although I prefer to wear mine open um, but I do want to pick up another trench coat in a lighter beige color I'm actually thinking about this one from H&M I don't know it's super cute let me know if you guys think I should go ahead and pick it up I'm actually holding off on picking up a lot of coats until black Friday because you guys you can get some really really good deals on Black Friday I actually plan on doing a Black Friday shopping tips and tricks in the near future so make sure you guys subscribe and hit that notification bell so you don't miss that video next item that we have up is another trench coat well I guess this is yeah I would describe this as like a trench coat pea coat but it's definitely in a more heavier material it's in this wool material now this is in this beautiful gray color now I picked this up in a size large Again, I wanted this to be super oversized, but part of me regrets it just a little bit because it's a little bit too big on me, but I think I got this for a really good price. I think it was like 20 bucks. I think this is definitely a coat that you can dress up for work or church, or you can just wear it on a casual day with a hoodie and some faux leather leggings or leather trousers and some tennis shoes. And from Forever 21, this is really good quality and I did not pay a ton for it. My last coat is gonna be this Zara Aviator coat. I love this coat. This coat is my ride or die. I actually bought this coat last year during Black Friday. I am actually planning on doing a Black Friday shopping tips and tricks video for you guys. So if you guys want to see that video, be sure to hit that notification bell so you don't miss that upload because I got this coat for literally 30% off. I think this coat is originally $150, $160 and I think I only paid about $105 for the coat. I absolutely love this jacket. It's so warm, so sturdy, goes with almost everything actually it probably does go with everything i wore this to death this was like one of the best coat purchases that i made it definitely gives you an oversized boyfriend style but it's not too big to the point where again it's swallowing you um and i picked this up in a size small which is perfect i would not go up a size in this because then it would just be way too huge on me i love this coat this coat is my baby i will keep this coat for years on years i think this coat is definitely worth every single penny okay babes I really hope you guys enjoyed this video as much as I enjoyed filming it for you I wanted to let you guys know I'm currently doing a giveaway which ends on November 10th which is the coming Sunday so if you guys want to know how to enter that and win a Zara gift card so you can maybe pick up some items from this haul be sure to check out that video I'll link it up here and also in the description box below and yeah guys I'll see you next Sunday love you